Hi guys and girls and welcome back to another video. In this video I'm going to be showing you a click to move system in Unity. This is great for beginners and it's going to be very quick. Let's get started. First thing I'm going to create a new cube and I'm going to click F2 on my keyboard and rename this to floor. This is going to be our floor obviously and I'm going to set its scale to 10, 1 and 10. Also I want to change my position to 0, 0, 0. Next I'm going to create a cube and rename it to player. I want to set its position to 0, 1 and 0. We can't see our player very well so I'm just going to create a new material. Name that material player.material, drag it onto our player and change its albedo value to a, let's go with a blue. I'll go to my player and add in a nav mesh agent component. This is going to allow us to move our player. But now we have to bake a navigation mesh to our floor cube. So if you go up to window and go navigation, you'll get this window right here. You want to select the object and then set it to be static and also to be walkable. Go over to bake and just click bake and you'll have your navigation mesh. All we have to do now is create a new script. I'll name it player movement. Open it up. First, I'm going to set my script to use unity engine.ai. This allows us to use the navigation mesh commands. I'll create a new variable for our navigation mesh. I'll call it agent. And in void start, I'm going to set our agent to be equal to get component nav mesh agent. Simply what we're doing is just getting this component right here from our player. This is the most important part here. So in void update, what we have to do is we have to see where our mouse is on the screen, then send a raycast from our mouse position to the ground and then move our player there. So we could do that by going if input dot get mouse button down. So this is when we click the mouse button. If you set this to zero, then that's your left click on, on your mouse. One is right click and two is middle mouse click. I'm gonna set mine to zero and then I'm just going to, we have to create a new ray that is going to go from our mouse position on the screen to a point in the world. We can do that by going array, ray, so we're creating a new ray, which is equal to camera dot main. So that is the main camera in our scene that we're using for our player dot screen point ray. And now we type in input that mouse position. So we're going from our mouse position to a point in the world. You can read more about this in the Unity documentation. Now we're going to say if physics that raycast. Here we're just going to input our ray, and then we're going to create a hit value. So this is where the raycast hit. And we also have to set the max distance of our ray, which I'm just going to set to in infinite. So go math f dot infinity. This doesn't work because we do not have our hit value anywhere. So once we click our middle, uh, once we click our left mouse button, sorry, uh, we're just going to create a raycast hit value, which is going to be hit. I'm just going to call it hit. And now that should work fine. Down here, we're going to say agent dot set destination to our point where it hit that point just like this. I am missing a parenthesis here. So this is very simple and this should work. So I have to drag my script to my player and click play. And now if we click anywhere, our player is going to move there. This is very basic and very simple, just right for beginners. And if this helped you, be sure to leave a like, comment down below if you have any suggestions for videos. And also um, subscribe and follow me on my social media because that's very important. There's a link to that in the description. And hopefully I'll see you next time. So bye bye.